Astipale is going to be the first green and sustainable island of the Mediterranean, but it is more than that. Astipale represents the new investment destination in the world in as far as Greece becoming a leader in innovative and technological projects of this manner. We've made a bold decision about a year and a half ago to shut down all of our lignite plants by 2023, with the exception of one, which is the most recent one, by 2028. That automatically leads to green energy and sustainability spectrum in our thinking, in our policy making, in attracting investment in this direction. So what we've done is to promote the idea of RES, renewable energy sources, to make up for the space that is created from the shutting down of the lignite plants, which is the old news. Astipale is a typical example of how a country and a business firm can work together for the benefit of the people. We have shown together in Astipalia a picture today of the future. In Astipalia, we will demonstrate how the mobility that is going to be addressed in 10 years' time is going to be like. So we've changed the uh, typical transportation into what we call mobility on demand. There's going to be charging stations and there's going to be all the support that is needed to provide the infrastructure for the entire island to run on electrical vehicles. So practically speaking, in the future, you will not need to have one car to go from to where you want to go. You may either call the e-van to pick you up or use one of the shared services vehicles that is going to be available for you. Smart, sustainability, electrification, RES, shutting down lignite plants is a way of telling the world that Greece can do more than what others still try to conceive in as far as how to react in this particular sector of the economy.